What's up guys, my name is Alex, welcome back to a brand new video and in this exciting tutorial I'm going to show you guys how I created my uh, 2017 outro Just Alex Halford So a lot of people have been asking in the comments like dude please make a tutorial on this so on the very second day of this year I'm gonna show you guys in a Vegas 14 tutorial how to make this outro and I'm not saying that you guys uh, should like ask me to use certain music or sound effects or anything I just all the music is provided by no copyright sound so you guys don't need my permission to use the same song or or anything like that you guys can just keep you know watch this as, a, as an inspirational video like dude I want to make the exact same outro guys just go ahead and do it it's like my it's my truly you know uh, privilege to inspire you guys to create you know awesome high quality outros make sure to go ahead and follow along I'm gonna guide you guys through the entire process from making the thank you for watching uh, and the Twitter logos in Photoshop until the you know adding the music and the just Alex Helford uh, outro spoken by Arian.org make sure to go ahead and stay tuned and I will catch you guys in Vegas 14 and Photoshop CC 2014 as well so make sure to smash the like button down below already and I would say let's go all right guys so as you can see right now we are in the folder of everything that I used uh, to create this outro so we're gonna start off with the first thing which is just a normal uh, picture as you can see if I make it full screen it is just a simple blue background with two lines I just added two white lines and I just lower the opacity it's really simple so I'm gonna open up the PSD the Photoshop file of this uh, outro and I'm gonna show you guys how I made everything so as you guys can see when I open up the project in Photoshop it is loading uh, the actual template well it's not a template I really created this myself I didn't use any templates at all I'm gonna show you guys and run through everything that I did to create this outro in its entirety so I would say let's go Dio. let's wait until this finished loading and then I'm gonna show you guys how I made this one from adding the Twitter logo the text uh, everything the really small details so I'm gonna just uncheck all layers so you guys can see what I did and what I added so I would say as you can see right now this is the Photoshop file uh, that I made for this outro so as you can see right now what we have we have pretty I'm gonna just you know uncheck all the layers so you guys are able to see what I did exactly so we're gonna start off with a uh, blue background as you can see what I did then is, is this this one is also just just a blue background with a white circle but the circle is really big as you can see this is one part and I just lowered the opacity then I'm gonna just add in the other half of the circle as you can see right there boom like that so this is basically what I did I just added because I, I can move this one as you can see this is just a part of a circle nothing special about that so this is what I did then I added some thunder to it I just googled like thunder uh, because if I if I drag this one as you can see this is just some really small thunder and you're thinking dude the thunder is glowing in the video I'll catch you guys in just a minute where I'm going to show you guys how this is glowing so as you can see this is just a thunder uh, or lightning how you want to call this picture in the corners that's a symbol of this then I just started adding text you have been watching I can really like ch change the text if I want to you have been watching and then I just added just Alex Halford underneath it I can change this one to uh, fluffy snowflake HD <laughs> but I'm not gonna do that because this is that's not my YouTube name just Alex Howard is my YouTube name then I just started adding other things like check this one too and I place this guy right here because on the YouTube the new end screens you can place videos right here so that's what I did as well then I'm gonna also add in the social media I just can I just you know uh, typed in follow me I just pressed the one uh, that one and I just placed it on there then we have the Instagram logo and the Twitter logo uh, what I did really simple is just I just added the Instagram logo made it white also added the Twitter bird made it also white twitter.com instagram.com and I just made those ones it those because there were a few layers uh, this in this small picture 
if I'm just going to uh, uncheck this one, as you can see, not that one, this one, those were one, two, three, four, five, six layers. I just made that one and I just created six layers into one, really simple. And I just added also the Instagram logo, really simple, this, the Twitter bird. And then also that's what, that's what I always say to end off my videos, I'm always ready. I just uh, made a little blue bar with always ready on there. What I did then is just, I just typed, you know, put my just Alex Halford logo with a, with a uh, transparent background. And as you can see, this is how I came to create this outro. So now what I did, I just saved this one to uh, a JPEG, the highest quality possible. And those were all the layers. That's how I made it in Photoshop. So let's go over back to the folder and let's open up uh, the project. So I have two projects. I'm going to first start off with the first one. Let's see which one that is. All right, guys. So as you can see right now, this is the project with the music as well. So this is nothing too special about it. I just don't have like uh, uh, my 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 last name and my, my youtube name at the end so this is the wrong project so i'm gonna open up this one outro.veg so that should open up the right project with all the files uh containing so let's just go ahead and let this load so as you guys can see uh, right now this is basically uh, my outro so as you guys saw at the previous project let me open up that one real quick you guys are wondering like what is the flashing going on and what is like the how do you make those uh, those uh, thunder uh, flashes like move well guys it's really simple this is basically what I added if I mute this track this is basically what I added in terms of um, how you call this like uh, light leaks So as you guys can see, this is just this is the effect that I applied on that I applied on it. So if I go to source alpha and if I mute this track, this is basically what I have laid over just the Photoshop picture. This is what I have as a layer. So if I go over and place this one on screen, and if I unmute this, this is what we have, guys. That's what I do, but if I do it to overlay, this is how it looks. And as you can see right now, those lightning things in the corner are glowing, but that's how I did it. If I go over and place this one to source alpha, if I mute this track, this is just a small effect that makes the glows, the thunder glow in the corner. That is basically what I did. So what I did is I just, you know, took this one, I lowered the opacity uh, of this clip to 62%. I placed this one to overlay. If I just unmute this one, and then you have just this outro with the overlay, as you guys saw, and that that's how it makes the glow, the thunder glow in the corner and my logo also right there. So that's what I did. What I just did is I just rendered that out. And if I go over and don't save this, if I go over to the other Vegas project, as you can see, I just have the rendered um, song with uh, the glowing in the corner and everything as you can see but then also at the end this i have added this and a lot of people have been asking like how i did that well it's really simple guys i'm just going to go over frame for frame so if i go over and and play this if i go over to the end i added the sound effect it's this one that one if i play it back only the sound this is what it sounds like So that's what I added as well. That is just basically a simple sound effect I found online. And then as you can see, it just goes from, if I go frame for frame, it's going really fast as you can see. But if I just go frame by frame, it is just zooming. Well, it just is adding a vignette going away. As you can see, it zooms out and then it goes over to text, just Alex Halford. And then it adds in like this effect. If I play only the effect, this is what it looks like. And this is called a lens flare animation free overlay stock footage. So that's what I dragged over. But if I would, because if I would drag it all the way to the beginning, this is how it how it looks. I just cut it right there. So if I drag it to here, this is what it looks like. I just timed it really well, and that is how I made my outro, guys. It is really simple. Just added a small uh, vignette and a, a zoom out effect, as you can see, and then I just timed it on the sound effect. I just typed in just Alex Halford, as you can see. This is just a random text file. That's what I did, and then it just appears right here. Boom, and you're wondering, how is it visible through that? Well, I just changed the opacity, I mean the compositing mode from source alpha to screen, so I can see through the black, and we have the blue appearing, and this is how I made the outro. 
with a random fade out at the end. And that's how I made it, guys. That's how I made my 2017 outro. Uh, it is that simple. That's how I did it. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video. This is the full outro that I made for my 2017 videos. So I hope this video was helpful to you. And that is it. So that's it for the video, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you guys for liking and subscribing. This is how I made my 2017 outro. It is that simple. So if you like this video, make sure to smash the like button down below and also subscribe down below. Make sure to do that. So and then comment below, uh, like I subscribed, I'm done. And then I'll be making sure to like the comments. So thank you guys for the support and I will see you guys tomorrow for a Vegas 14, well, a Vegas 13 compilation as always on Tuesday. So I will see you guys on Tuesday. Just Alex Halford.